But yeah, so I've uh, been getting into my fitness. This week I've been a bit slack, but I think it's just because work's been a bit busy. Yeah, you've been working a lot. Yeah. Um, I've actually, uh, not to like brag or anything, I was talking to Tash about it, I think Thursday night, but um, I've lost, I think I've lost weight and it's kind, it's kind of a bit annoying actually because um, I can't wear my jeans without a, a uh, belt now. Not as like good. I have, to, I have to wear a belt. Yeah. And it's like, it'd be nice to just put a pair of pants on and just walk out of the house. But now everyone has to look at my underwear if I don't wear a belt. You're going to be gay yeah. stuff. Yeah, you're not black enough to pull pull off pants <laughs> pulling down. That's also a signal in the prison yards that you're you ready for fucking... Anal. Look, whether you've got a belt or not, I'm going. Mm. <laughs> I'm going I'll just use it. that belt to choke you a little bit harder. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, daddy. Uh, Tasha's over there like, oh, please. Please talk about geez. belts and choking. <laughs> Don't but anyway. Stop thinking about me being choked by a belt boys. Right? It's funny. Uh, not, Ethan, not... what the fuck have you been doing all week? I wasn't thinking about that. Ben's week. Finish your week, Ben. So yeah, just uh <laughs> It just felt like a mum, like, like you, it just felt like I was being roused at by my mum. <laughs> and like, imagine your mum telling you not to think about her getting <laughs> choked by a belt. And I was like, Sorry, mummy. <laughs> like, but, my mum's telling me not to like, think about her being choked. But Bryce is the only one here that doesn't have a sister named Tash. So, yeah. like, <laughs> that's weird. <laughs> Anyway. Oh, God, now I'm thinking of my sister getting yeah, choked exactly. by a belt. exactly. That's what you fucking get. Imagine Tash second number ta- Tash two. Tash number two. Why? Tash no. secondary Tash getting no. choked by a belt. Oh, that's another thing, actually. I didn't think I talked about this last week, is that I applied for... Uh, I'm helping my sister out. Uh, she she lives in the UK at the moment. And um, my, my grandma is from Liverpool, so we have, like, English heritage. And so my sister can get uh, a heritage visa. Let's keep doing it. All right, ancestry visa. Um, and she just needed a bit of monetary assistance, and I was able to get a, a loan approved to loan her some money for it. So hmm. I'm actually... Um, I, so she can come back here and then she can eventually come back here, go yeah. back to the UK because that's where she wants to leave. Yeah, home. a bit sooner. Her application starts this month. She's applied for it. And then she has to come back here to, like, secure it, and then go. she can go back over. Um, she's going to be coming back in August. She's going to be coming back here in August. But um, just when I went over there for my trip, I just I saw how her lifestyle was, and I I fully believe that she belongs over there. Like she's made so many friends over there. She's made herself at home there, mm. and I just I fully believe that London is where she belongs. So it's like I come to yours once, or your mum's house once when she was she was living with your mum, mm. and your mum your sister just seemed very like in a room. Oh yeah, she is like. When she would li- lived over here, she was very much like introverted, watched YouTube all the time. She's the one who got me onto uh, Funhouse and Achievement Hunter and all that. Oh my God, thank you. I want to thank your sister when I see her. <laughs> and like she was the one who was always like TV shows and all of this stuff. And now like I went over to the UK, I did not recognize her because she was always like, uh, she she doesn't watch TV ever. Mm. She is, she uh, almost every night she's like out and about. If she's not working, she's... Uh, out with her friends, yeah, hanging out, and they're just having fun, like us. Her, Aww, but we don't go out no, unless we well, have, I, have to. Yeah, I really don't like doing that. Like, I, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I don't I mean, mind I a bar setting. I, I really, I really would like to go out. That's I'm what we're doing tonight. I know. birthday tonight. We're doing that. Okay, I'm like, I get to go actually see some live pussy. <laughs> I'm willing to like get out of my <laughs> women safe zone. Women, we're real if women. We, if Wait, we get what? to, a, oh, is that what you call them? If we get to a point in the night, we'll go to a strip club. Oh, yeah, <gasps> sober, sober Ben at a strip yes, club. If you ask a strip club, I have to come. Oh, yeah. Yes. I have to come. You... <laughs> <laughs> Sound like had... I'm never going to go there. I'll get the belt. <laughs> <laughs> Title of the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get the belt. I was actually waiting for Tash to do the whole <laughs> eek again at the end. Yeah, if you guys uh, go to a strip club, let me know because I'll make my way from the gig to meet you there. Just to the strip club. Yeah, yeah fuck yeah. All right. But that means you have to convince like Brie and her whole birthday party to go. What if well, we could, I'm pretty we, sure Brie's not going to take that. And the, and not going to be that hard to it, convince. Yeah, and then she could get lap dance. Yeah, yeah birthday lap dance. Yeah. Someone, Bryce, someone give her a hug and be like, I'll shout your lap dance, babe. <gasps> All right. Fuck yeah. 
Yeah. That's a good birthday present. But what if she then like slaps twenty dollars down I... my underwear? Do I have to take my pants off? Yes, yes. you have. To, oh, okay. You have to lap dance. Yeah, now you have to give the lap dance. But oh, like, okay. also, can for my birthday, can I have a lap dance? Yes, yes. we'll pay you for one. Yeah, yeah sure. Choose, you got to choose your girl. You get to choose the girl. You know, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be like Christmassy themed too, because it's December. Yeah. So we oh, have yes. like little elves it's owing up on you. It's literally four days before Christmas. It's gonna be yeah. fucking oh, rocking. So That's gonna be the most busiest ding, time. Ding, 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 no, do. it's not, because everyone around Christmas is spending time with their family. No, but or then whatever. they'll be sad losers, not. No, no, no. The don't no, because the the, the, the roast. Ones are pretty dead around Christmas. Really? Because everyone spends time with their family or whatever. No, there's a roast place right next door to the eye candy. They've got turkey in there. You're headed to the strip I, club. The, a girl they bring went, the kids no, along. No, no, it's a no, fun no, time. No. A girl I went to high school with that was literally two grades below me works at eye candy now. We'll get oh, a, sl- we'll get a lap dance from her for you. <laughs> she nah. tried so hard. I, I mean. I thought eye candy was like a jewelry so- store. I candy. No, it's a it's a strip club. It's oh, one like it's right a... across from the train station. Never yeah. seen it. Fortitude Valley. No one has ever shown me this. I candy. We'll it's out. right next to Crowbar and Cabaret Club. Which I've is never. I, don't, club. I've never I been think this is a point city. of the valley that he's never been. I've never actually. been to the valley because he's usually driven in. Or we've yeah, we've been to anyway. Hayabar. We've never caught the train there. No, yeah. that's the opposite side. Hayabar's the opposite. Well, side. I've never been to Crowbar. I've never been to Hayabar. I've never been to any of those. But the only one I went to was that one we went the last, the other, the gaming one. Oh, that's Netherworld. it. I'm, I'm oh, Netherworld. Netherworld. Oh, yeah. we've walked near. We've walked near Eye Candy from Netherworld. Oh, okay. Netherworld across the street and then Bryce, back down. Okay. All right, we're gonna have to. One week, we're gonna have. To I've never been clubbing in the city. You guys I've are gonna have to suck at the fuck up, I've and we're been, gonna take Bryce. I've only been clubbing <laughs> twice. Me, in me my and Ben life. are like, oh, outside. We're gonna have to. <laughs> you guys are gonna have to suck at the fuck up. We're going to Crowbar. We're gonna go to Eye Candy. We're gonna go to Cabaret Club. We might go to Netherworld. We'll go to Sabotage. If we're ever in the city, let's go to the beat. We'll take him to the beat. Okay, no, actually, I'm probably going to get raped by gay guy there. Yeah, you won't like the beat. Why not? You won't like the beat. No, he'll love the beat. He'll love the beat. There's very flamboyant people there. (laughs) He'll love the beat. (laughs) Oh, no, I'm going to, I want to, can we go? No, I'm not saying that's a problem. I'm just saying it's going to be fun. No, but my my, my argument to this is that, like, um... Like, my problem is that they're, they're not, just loud and in my face. Like, it's got nothing to do with them uh, uh, sucking dick. They're no, just no, loud no, and no, in no, my no. face. I, I lead, which is every club ever. What I want to do is we go in there and we lead on all these guys thinking that they're going to get laid by us. And then we're like, no, sorry, we're straight and walk no, out. No, because then you'll, you'll become the next Me Too movement. Who cares? Me what, Too. What does it matter? <laughs> <laughs> as long as they don't stuff me in a barrel, I'll be no. fine. No, it's justified. Like, men are filthy. Yeah. Like I was hit on the other day at on work. that Me Too movement. I've got a I've got a topic about that actually. Yeah, good. Something <laughs> topical. You shit. That's because you're not <laughs> drinking. No, because yeah, cool. no, no, like I, I I could physically see it, and I feel bad for women. Like when guys sort of just click over that they they're like, ooh, a predator, like a prey. Ooh, a predator. Like a prey. Like the predator's eyes click over. Like I, I like so I, I look like guy. every time I watch. I, like, the I made movie. a gay accent about a a, a bottle of vodka. I was like, yeah, yeah, they're, they're, these two gay guys come in and they're like, oh, that, that rainbow one's for you. And then I'm like, huh, what's wrong with that? And like I did an accent, like better than, better than what I did just then. You got raped. You did a voice, yeah. A, a, a homosexualish voice. And then um, and then his eye, like I just physically saw his eyes just change. Like, oh. oh I'm gonna... And I was like, oh, men are pigs. Like, <laughs> men are pigs. Hey, man, sister. I was just, yeah, I just, oh. Like even gay men. Like that's, that's why I'm like, yeah. I wouldn't want to get too into the gay community, personally, for me. But we can still yeah, go there and later Guys on. are nice. We can still go but there like, I just, on. like, like, yeah. I, 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 You're not seeing the fun of this. Lead them on. Lead them on. Yeah, yeah anyway, down. we're going to take Bryce on the valley. Yeah. It's going to be so yeah. fucking fun. It could fun. be good. It could be good. I, I, will, I will do it because this is Bryce. He is my friend. And he has not been to a strip the club in, in the valley. Uh, they're so Never. fucking grotty, hey. They're Strip the clubs. Worst. Oh, they're, I've, been oh to, I've been to Hollywood showgirls down the coast, and that and the chick down there. This one chick's given like, so it's my twenty first, which is years ago now. But yeah. it's my twenty first, and years ago, now. years ago now. And my brother and my brother's friend Zaid, we all went down there together. And we went, and Corey's like, look, I'll shout you. So we like go, like we go for the first tr- th- like chick comes up, does a fucking lappy dance and like mm. shit like that, right? And then we only have like fifty dollars left between us. And that, and this chick comes up to us and she's like, oh, hi, how's your night? She's like, do you want me to give you a lap dance? And Corey's like, look, we've only got $50. What can we get for that? And she's like, I can give you 10 minutes each. Like, so each individually. And we're like, yeah, okay, cool. So we all go in the same room. But anyway, she didn't specify each being as in like one at a time. We all just went in there and sat down next to each other. So <laughs> my brother's next to me and Zay's on the other side. I'm in the middle and there's this fuck. My brother's just fucking cooked off of all these all the alcohol he's been having and fucking scented candles. <laughs> and, all these scented candles. And scented candles. And... <laughs> 
we're sitting down there and this chick comes up and she like starts on him first and she's coming up and then and she's like, now the only rule size is like you're not allowed to touch my pussy, obviously, and you're not allowed to yeah. like lick me or anything like that. So Corey's like, fine, oh, I won't be licking you. So he just sticks his tongue out just as she's like rubbing herself up along him. And that's so <laughs> oh, he's sneaky. like licking that. So he's technically <laughs> licking her nipple, but he's not actually moving his tongue. She's rubbing her nipple along his tongue. And that and and then I'm just like... There is, like, no fucking limits in this place, really. Like, <laughs> well, I mean, Cabaret Club does, like, $5 lappies. Oh, wow. That's rocking. Oh. So, like, I went once after I a wish, gig. Like, with that, I wish we had smaller notes. Yeah, well, like, I, <laughs> I went wish they had after better a gig slots. with, like, my mate and his mum. Yeah. I won't name and his mum and his mum. No, no, his mum's cool like my mum. Yeah. Anyway, we got there and she took, like, 100 bucks out in $5 notes. <laughs> <laughs> and we were all just having about a fucking wild time. There's, there's that one, of the, one of the strip clubs. I'm not, I don't know. I haven't confirmed which one it is. Mm. But one of them, you can get uh, something extra on top of the... The lap dance. Yeah, a special, a special a happy, uh, ending. happy ending. Yeah, oh. but I don't, I don't know which Over one it pants. is. Uh, like, I feel like that's a bit inappropriate of them to touch my junk. I'd be like, get back, look, you're here for a lap dance. Don't touch my penis. This is weird. I would, I'd be like, mm, I just want you to dance on me. Can you just dance? Do you on have me? a lot of repressed sexual feelings? I feel it's like there's so a lot weird of repressed when they sexual just feelings. Just dance on you, though. Did, no, like grind on you and stuff. But like, yeah, don't touch my gotta, dick. You just did, gotta sit there and be hard. Did your mum make you get raped once? No, like you're allowed to put your hands on them. Just don't touch their vagina. But you I'm just like, ignore that question like, completely. <laughs> <laughs> no, what? But got still, raped by no, no. Did your mum make you get raped once? Yeah, but uh, yeah. still, yeah. it's just like. What do you do with your hands? You touch their legs and stuff. You no, can, but what if you no? You, you grab their I ass you and you, most no, of the time. You're not you can, to touch you can the, pop your hands on like you pop your hands on like their uh, hips, like their love handles and stuff like that. That area. Really? Sometimes you can touch their titties. Holly would show guys um, you can touch their titties and everything. Sometimes you can touch, you can, their, you can touch their ass, like give them a spanking. Sometimes. Yeah, man. I've had a couple of girls where this I've just shit. like I like I've done it like lightly, being like. Oh, I'm naughty. And she's just like, Ooh, um, do you call that a spank? I'm like, oh. okay, smack. And she's just like, that's better. <laughs> I had this one chick when, it, when we're getting lap tans. And that that she, like, she like bends over. I'm just like, that's a nice bleached ass. So I like double slapped it. She's like, oh, and you could see like an ass. I'm like, <laughs> clench <laughs> up. <laughs> I still remember it so vividly. I'm just like. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I was just like, oh. <laughs> I mean, did you even hit her if it doesn't leave like a welt? That's it. Yeah.